welcome to my channel so for this video i'm going to be making a minimal mermaid silhouette wedding dress and here i'm just doing a quick sketch of how i want the dress to look like then i started to drape I really love draping I prefer seeing whatever I'm doing in 3D form rather than 2D form so for example for dresses I really love to drape because I know and I can see what I'm doing and I prefer drafting patterns for coats, blazers, trousers Just draping um, a bustier, four panels, and a bra cup. And I am also draping a princess line skirt. Just transferring all I've draped on paper so this is my chance for like adjusting giving seam allowances you know sizing it and all that this fabric because it literally looks like pearls it's kind of difficult to use though in terms of like ironing it gets wrinkled so quick and here I'm just cutting my patterns doesn't like cotton fabrics I mean I really do not like cotton fabrics that's like my least favorite thing to do here I'm just putting together everything and I wanted this bustier to look sleek so I didn't add any bonings but I realized it was a mistake after I was finished and after wearing it on my mom flat my seams this can actually make or break your outfit when you sew so ironing is important and here I'm just working on the cups and I'm going to sew a rectangle panel in between the seams of the cups and then connect it to the back so that will be like a little off shoulder sleeve Just working on the skirt here, sewing the panels together and then sewing the front and the back together. Oh by the way guys, don't mind the way I put my pins, I know, I know it's the wrong way, it's supposed to be horizontal but I really like find it easier this way because I don't have time to remove pins. 
bustier and my skirt and I'm going to sew them together no I sewed them together uh, for my lining fabric I just sewed it exactly how I sewed the actual dress and I hand stitched it around I like hand stitching my lining fabric like it's just a thing for me so you don't have to you could use your machine and I use invincible stitches actually when I'm sewing on my lining and here I'm just sewing the zipper with some seam allowance there in the back which I trim and I'm just finishing up the lining doing some invincible stitches on the zipper on the inner part and here just making an embellished sash to cover the waist because I really don't like it showing so I just hand stitched all the stones basically the whole video it's just a simple dress and didn't have a lot of lace didn't have any lace I just wanted to do something clean and uh, hope you guys like it there will be more videos coming soon the thing is this video take a long time to make and probably I'll be uploading once a month or like twice a month because I'm also busy doing some other stuff so I hope you guys like this video and I'm not so used to this voiceover thing but uh, let's see I'll continue 